Let's talk about SGN, or the Soul Genomics Network. Um, this is the, the home page for SGN, and if you look at the, the tools and data available, you'll find a lot of uh, information that parallels what's in TEAR. Um, I want to focus on the tomato genome data, so if you hit this button and move forward, um, what you can see here are the various releases of the Heinz 1706 draft genome sequence. So a little over a year ago, this information wasn't available. But in that time, so in a year, we now have two genomes available for tomato. We have the draft genome sequence for Heinz 1706, as well as the draft genome for LA1589, which is a Solanum pimpinella folium. Um, I want to emphasize that this, this um, data deluge isn't going to stop. There's a group from China that is currently seeking, sequencing 100 tomato genomes. Um, and so my guess is that within a year, instead of just two tomato genomes, we're going to have closer to 102. Um, so it's kind of up to us to figure out how to make use of that information. Okay. SolCap's contribution to these um, genome resources came from the GA2 sequencing of transcribed sequences or transcriptomes. And Alan mentioned this briefly. What, what I want to mention is that um, specifically um, there are a number of varieties that we have sequenced. And so this Ohio 9242 represents a processing variety. So if you, if you take this inf the information for this variety and compare it to Heinz 1706 or TA 496, which is the variety that was used for a lot of the EST work, um, those all represent processing backgrounds. So TA 496 is essentially derived from Harris Moran variety um, E 6203. Yeah. Um, okay, so, so there are at least three, there, there's pretty deep sequencing for at least three processing varieties. The next three varieties, Florida 7600, NC84173, and uh, 6405, all represent fresh market genetic backgrounds. Okay, and so there are now a number of resources available uh, for the fresh market lineages. P114490, PI114490 is a, is a cherry type or Sevraciformi type, and then PI128216 is a Pimpinella folium. Um, I'm mentioning that because if you look at the GRIN website, it's listed as an Esculentum, but it's clearly a Pimpinella folium. And this is one of several sources of resistance to bacterial spot. 